guys, Mike. I'm back with my 1977 Corvette, and today we're going to gravity bleed the brakes. You can do this to all four brakes, same procedure. Just keep in mind, we're gonna talk about a couple quick things. I wanna make this video as quick as possible for you because it is easy, and I want it to be easy for you to understand as well as perform. Some of the reason I'm, or the main reason I'm bleeding the brakes today is I replaced my brake booster that has nothing to do with fluid and at the same time on Summit Racing it had a uh, package deal to replace the master cylinder at the same time. They'll send you a new master cylinder, make sure you get a good coating painted on um, or uh, a good oil to keep that cast iron finish nice. A um, couple reference points here. front or the cylinder closest to the driver is for the rear brakes. This one, the front one, is for the front brakes. So when we're bleeding, you want to keep this topped up, okay? You don't want it to go dry because it'll suck in there and then you'll have to start all over. All right, so yes, um, for those who are wondering, I did bench bleed this ahead of time. I can explain that later, but uh, that, that is when you get a new master cylinder and you have to bench bleed it. Anyway, without further ado, right now I've got both tires off in the rear. I've got them both bleeding. I've got trashy fluid mixture with water because one of my calipers blew out and now I'm just purging all the bad fluid. So start by jacking up the uh, rear. I've got two jacks as you can see my jack is just on standby and then take a 5 16 wrench and crack open the highest two over here bleeder valves as long as your caliper is lower than the master cylinder gravity is going to do what it does and start naturally purging out that fluid. It's just gonna keep flowing down here, okay? As you can see, I'm doing both at the same time. Just crack them open and let it flow. Both that one and that one. Nothing to it. While that is purging out all the bad fluid, you need to keep, again, Close, con close eye on the current cylinder that you are, or the current bank of the master cylinder that you are purging right now. So I'm about to add fluid to this. All right, I hope that helps. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to ask. As long as the master cylinder is higher than the caliper, it will flow. That's why it's called gravity bleeding. This is great because you can bleed your brakes of all the bad fluid as well as um, get new fluid in there, get a healthy start after you just changed out components on your brake system. And you will stop once you see that dripping clear fluid. You can test multiple times with a little clear cup if you want to check that. All right, I hope this helped. Thanks. And of course, keep these pups on the road. Gravity bleeding, nice clear fluid.